Many local voters having already received their ballot for the upcoming election, reporter Derek Stahl takes an in-depth look on the new way to track your ballot and make sure it's counted. Right now, the U.S. Postal Service is processing an unprecedented number of mail-in ballots. Because of the pandemic, election officials are sending mail ballots to every active registered voter in California for the first time in state history, says Secretary of State Alex Padilla. Vote by mail has been popular in California for many, many years. But with a further increase in vote by mail participation, the transparency and accountability of those mail-in ballots uh, is even more paramount. That's why the secretary rolled out a new tool statewide for this election called Where's My Ballot? The system can send texts or emails alerting you when a ballot has been mailed to you, when the election office has received it, when the ballot has been counted, and more. We know which voters haven't returned their ballot yet, so we can carve out just that subset of voters and send them a, a message that says, you need to act on your ballot. You have 10 days to do so. Steve Olson is the president of Ballot Tracks, the company that created the software. It works by tracking the barcodes on ballots and envelopes. When employees scan the barcode, the company collects the data. Where's My Ballot can even send you an alert if your ballot has been rejected for, say, a missing signature, something the voter can go back and correct. We can tell the voter your ballot has been rejected, you know, within minutes of receiving that data. Ballot Tracks originally developed the technology back in 2009 for election officials in Denver. They're now in 400 counties in 14 states. Hopefully our system adds a level of, of comfort and peace of mind and confidence and trust that their vote's actually going to count. But it's not just a tool for voters. The tracking system gives election officials a way to keep tabs on the Postal Service, which the state recently sued successfully over claims the Trump administration was slowing down the mail. It provides us a sort of a real-time look at ballot traffic through the mail. And if we identify any bottlenecks or delays, then we can work with regional and local postal service representatives to address those and ensure the timely delivery of ballots both to the voter and back to the county.